Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the brand new, this season's Lidl gliders. As you can see, they are blue and white. The other is black and white with a red canopy. These are available as of Thursday, the 28th of May, 2020. So you need to prepare. If you're going to make a powered version of this, you need to order from Bangwood, B-A-N-G, wood, a motor, and this was, I think, £8.50. For that, you get the motor, you get a 30 amp speed controller, and with this speed controller, you will get a DINs connector, and on your battery that will look like that. Okay, this is not the batteries I'm using. You will need to put some Velcro on your batteries and the other half in the canopy of your little glider. With the motor, you get the speed controller, you get the mount, you get some odds and sods here with the screws. You get the uh, adapter to put the prop on. You get two props. These are EP6035, which is a six inch by three and a half pitch, I think. Currently I'm using a six by, uh, by four. You don't need anything bigger than this. Uh, please don't try because you're just gonna end up having a fireball. So there's your prop, your prop adapter, your motor, your speed controller, your spare prop, adapters for your props so that they will go onto your adapters there that will fit in the middle of the propeller here. So you're going to need that and it all comes Okay, in this one bag here, and I'm going to put it all back so I don't lose it all. There you go. Okay, £8.50. You get the motor, the speed control, everything, everything you need. That goes in my box, ready. Okay, the next thing you're going to need, you're going to need some servos. These are made in China. This took about three days to get here. They are Tower Pro Micro Servo 9 gram SG90. I've never had these fail on me. They've always served me well. £8.50, you get five of them. Okay, you're only going to need three. You've got two spare. £8.50. I mean, come on. You know, you just... You, fantastic value. Okay. Um... I would suggest you get either a soldering iron or this purpose-made uh, cutter for the EPO film, uh, um, foam. You get the wand, it's detachable, you get the power supply with it, it's for a British plug. I think that was £6.50, something like that. This is great for digging things out inside the fuselage because you want to push your battery as far back to the centre of gravity as possible and also your receiver and everything else. So that comes in as a very good tool. I will be using that. That goes in my box. Now I use Spectrum for my radio gear. Uh, this is the older type. This is the newer type. The newer type, uh, it doesn't tell you where to put the connections. It just says battery data, one, two, three, four. But basically if you can copy that where it says uh, rudder, elevator, aileron, throttle, battery. It's just the opposite way around. And you can then, I highly recommend buying a Y lead. And the reason you need a Y lead is because that one connects to the right hand uh, 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 servo for the ailerons and the left hand servo for the ailerons. They get mixed into this one plug and that goes boop, straight in there into your receiver and you, ha you don't have to do any mixing with your radio whatsoever. They just go in opposite directions when you are using your aileron controls. So that will now go in my box. You need some lollipop sticks. You can buy them online. These I uh, borrowed from a coffee shop. I got a whole handful of them and I put them inside the 
cockpit to strengthen the walls there because when you hit the ground rather harder than you um, anticipated which you will the cockpit doesn't break in half they're very very good and very very light uh, some control horns I use these for the ailerons not so much for the elevator I think they're great they're really good quality they're about three pounds uh, the other type is the normal plastic type control horn these are probably a little bit more expensive they're about three and a half pounds I think something like that you're going to need some five minute epoxy I haven't used this up yet it's looking rather worn five minute epoxy okay and of course your battery um, I use a 3s 11.1 volt um, battery and that's all you need with the Dean's connector and that is what you need so you've got one week until you can go and buy that go and order your stuff now and don't forget to buy your velcro that goes on the back of your battery it seats inside of the uh, fuselage and it doesn't rattle around and velcro you can use in most things some people even use it to keep the uh, the canopy on I use it for the battery I also put some velcro on the speed controller and that goes into the top of the canopy and I just lift it off and it's all there nothing's moving around and everything's cool and groovy so ah and don't forget you're going to need to buy uh, some carbon fiber tubing this is five mil by three I also have a little bit of uh, carbon solid rod which is 2.5 by 1 millimeter that's for strengthening your fuselage and for your wing you will need it you can use spruce spruce is very good but carbon fiber is even lighter and will take a lot of punishment that will really bend before you break it um, but spruce is good but it's just a little bit heavier weight is not everything at the end of the day you're going to build something that's highly aerobatic uh, some of you will be making slope saurus some of you will be making power gliders which are slope saurus there's no such thing really as a glider it won't glide you can saw slope saw it or you can power it making a glider forget it it's, it hasn't got the lift but it has on a slope and it has as a powered model so remember if you're intending to make a glider forget it if you want a slope saw go for it okay powered go for it but as a glider standalone glider with your tow hook forget it it's just it's not going to stay in the air long enough to you for you to enjoy it so that's what you need you've got one week to sort yourself out I expect they'll be on sale for about three four weeks and that'll be your lot so you got a week to get your gear Go to Bangwood and eBay. Okay, good flying.